Hi guys! This is Jules and welcome to my Friday Reads. This I believe is my 23rd Friday Reads if I'm not mistaken. But hopefully you guys can hear me decent. I can't be too loud because my um, father-in-law is sleeping across the hall. Um, future father-in-law. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and get started with this Friday Reads. The book I am reading, currently reading, in Amber and the Ashes by Saba Tahar. Try to do this with one hand. There you go. And that's the back. This book is good. I'm really enjoying this book. I can't wait to finish it. I'm actually almost done with this book. As you can see, I only got about 100 pages to go. Um, I'm like this much I only have to go. So it's not a lot. That's all I gotta do. Read. And I am on page 341. So, I've read all this, so, yeah, almost done. I'll finish this by tomorrow, and then I'll um, see what happens, and, um, I may do a review on this, because I'm actually really enjoying this book. I can't wait till the second book comes out. It don't come out until, like, in the summer of this year, so that's August 30th. So I got a little bit of a wait, a little bit of a slight bummer. So, but it, after I finish this, I'm gonna go ahead and read this next book, which is, whoops, okay, upside backwards here. Sorry about that. Red Rising by Pierce Brown. Um, I heard some hype on it. Not much. I don't know much. I just know it is, um, give me a minute to try to do this with one hand. Um, so, something about Mars, surface of Mars, and this generation is trying to basically, um, change things, it looks like, and, um, pretty much make this society a better place than what it is because it sounds like it's not good so um but yeah we'll have to see when I get to this because that's about all I really know just I can go ahead and read the interpretation on the inside the um summary it says I live for the dream that my children would be born free she says, that they will be what they like, that they will own the land their father gave them. I live for you, I say sadly. Eo kisses my cheek. Then you must live for more. And then it goes, Dario is a red, a member of the lowest castade in the color code society of the future. Like his fellow reds, he works all day. Believing that he and his people are making the surface of Mars livable for future generations. Yet he spends his life willingly, knowing that his blood and sweat will one day result in a better world for his children. But Dario and his kind have been betrayed. Ooh. Soon he discovers that humanity already reached the surface generations ago. Best cities and sprawling parks spread across the planet. Dario and Reds like him are nothing more than slaves to a decadent ruling class. It's pretty much similar to the one I'm reading where in this book one's a slave and one's a soldier. So similar. Inspired by longing for justice and driven by the memory of lost love, 
Dario sacrifices everything to infiltrate the legendary institute, a proving ground for the dominant gold cascade, where the next generation of humanity's overlords struggle for power. He will be forced to compete for his life in the very future of civilization against the best and most brutal of society's ruling class. There, he will stop at nothing to bring down his enemies, even if it means he has to become one of them to do so. So, yeah, it sounds similar, especially that last part, because right now the soldier had to decide what's one thing against the other, and they're so similar. So, yeah, it sounds kind of similar, this one, to... Um, the one I'm reading, give me a minute, similar to, we'll just do this, to this one that I'm reading. So, they're both similar, so, let's see if you can see those. Try to do this one-handed. So, that's what I'm going to be reading this weekend. Fishing that one, starting this one. So, <coughs> excuse me. So, that's what I plan on reading this weekend. Let me know in the comments below what you guys plan on reading this weekend. Um, that's it for this quick Friday reads. And I'm actually recording on Friday, late Friday. Um, and Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.